What's going on guys? Welcome back. Max here. Hope you're all having a great day. Today we're going to be checking out a scene from Ip Man 3. Someone told me this is Donnie Yen fighting a Muay Thai fighter. So I heard Muay Thai. We have to check it out. I'm super excited. Hope that you are. Let's go. All right. Oh, they're one of those old school elevators. Okay, so right away the Muay Thai guy should have the advantage here, I think. Clinch, knee, elbow, done, right? <laughs> Barefoot, definitely Muay Thai. Oh. So right away it looks a little bit more like Muay Baran with like the open hand kind of thing going on here. Not seeing, I mean I saw a knee, but not a whole lot of Muay Thai yet. Nice deflection by Donnie. Oh, fist to the throat. Oh, damn, that knee dented the damn boards. Okay, there's a little more Muay Thai. We see the elbows. See, what the... A teep in that, in that closer range? Nah, no way. And besides, he doesn't want to keep Donnie away. He wants to get him in close. The Muay Thai fighter should be clinching and kneeing and elbowing, that would make more sense to me, to be honest, in such an enclosed space, rather than trying to like make distance with a push kick. The situational awareness of uh, Ip Man in these movies is next level. Now he can fight freely because he doesn't need to protect the girl. Stands there and lets him hit him four times in the face. Okay, so Muay Thai guy throwing a hook kick, no way. This is a straight up Taekwondo guy, I can tell you now. <laughs> oh. Damn, stomped him across the across the stairwell. Okay, there we go. A little back elbow. Looking a little. Oh, damn! Oh, 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 oh. Oh, that was sick. I mean, I don't like watching the Muay Thai guy get a little Sanchai cartwheel kick. I don't like watching the Muay Thai fighter get beat up, but uh, holy shit, that was the sickest team ever. Nice. Catching the kick like that, catching the kick underneath the way that he did is absolutely doable. I normally go over the top when I catch the kick, but catching the kick like underneath this way is absolutely doable and actually gives you some really nice options because you can elevate your opponent's leg, frame on their face, sweep their leg out and dump them down really, really hard. Like he just did. I think the most Muay Thai thing about this guy is his tattoos. <laughs> Just sends him limping away. And all before the elevator got down. Aww. As much as I hate seeing Muay Thai lose and uh, Itman having, you know, that plot armor, still, I think that the Muay Thai guy could have done a lot better uh, in the elevator there. They could have done a lot more with, like, some clinch. Um, and things like that with, you know, grabbing the head, controlling the arms, hitting the knees, kind of shutting down the Wing Chun style, like chain punches and stuff. But again, the choreography is obviously, it's tough to make a clinch look good for any sort of extended period of time. But uh, that was really cool. That teep kicking him down the stairs was sick. That was awesome. I love that. Uh, anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Our 101st, woo, what a way to kick off uh, the next 100 videos. Thank you for sticking around to the end. As always, guys, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like, comment down below what we should watch next, and then subscribe so when we get around to doing the scenes you want to see, you don't miss out. Until the next one, stay awesome, have a great day, bye.